Yo, what's going on boys? In this video, I'm going to show you the new best double movement settings to use in Fortnite Battle Royale and you are going to be utilizing a new thing called single key strafing. Now, it's not really new, but a lot of pros have been using it recently and I wasn't actually aware how good this new setting actually was until somebody in the comment section asked me a question if it was actually decent or not. But for the past two days, I've been testing it out myself and it's absolutely insane. I'm going to show you why it's insane right now. So you are going to open up your Wooting double movement settings and go down to where it says advanced mode. Click on to where it says strafing and make sure you have 59% strafe angle. But honestly, this is all entirely personal preference. If you want a strong of movement setting you can if you want a weaker one you can but the one thing that will absolutely insanely change your gameplay is enabling single key strafing 100% and i'm going to show you why in creative right now one movement trick that destiny jesus exposed ages ago in his one youtube video was making sure to press w and a to run into your left hand peak and as you can see when you press w and a you can perfectly right hand peak however now with this new weeting setting when you press a on its own you are now able to strafe intensely to the left giving you the best right hand peak in the game so how I'm going to show you is now when you press W and A, you can run into right and peak, right? And you're going to be like that. And you have to perfectly do it. It's not, it's not always 100% right and peak. Right? It's actually quite difficult to get every time. If you do get it, it's very nice. But now when you press A on its own, you go to the left and you have the perfect right and peak. You can literally stand on any point of the wall and just go completely to the left. Every single time. Like it's actually the best set you have to use. This, this set will single-handedly improve your movement, especially with window edits. Now it's a lot harder to actually W A move like with window edit. W A going back into it, but now A D again. A D. A D. It's so much better. You get a perfect round peak every single time. It will literally improve the gameplay so much more. But yeah, pros like Bugger and No Riley both use this setting, which does prove that it is literally one of the best settings to use. And No Riley has an insane movement, and he's using this one setting. A lot of you do ask how to improve your movement, and this will literally single handedly improve your movement. If you just start pressing A instead of W and A now, you can fully get out of the way of right hand and just strafe back into it. So if you do want to get better at using this double movement setting, just make sure to do these drills. So place that, place the phone, and press A while doing it. So, A cone shoot. A cone shoot. A cone shoot. Window edit cone shoot. Window edit cone shoot. Window edit cone shoot. You can also do double edit cone. The next map you want to load into to improve this is Raiders Mechanics Map V2. And go straight over to the peak shot even ground. And then make sure to. Make sure to strafe all the way to the left every time with A. You can practice these controllers all. As you can see, I'm not even being seen by the bot at all. And if you have an edit on release, and if you have an edit on release off, you can go. That's going to be it for this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to hit that subscribe button and make sure to use creative code Aubrey.